The following program is video supplemental instruction. VSI is brought to you by the Teaching Center, UF's Learning Support Center, www.teachingcenter.ufl.edu. Masses, oh, this is for fall 2010, by the way. Two equal masses are on opposite sides of a 10 meter long massless string which is hung on massless frictional pulley which is 8 meters above the ground. Initially, one mass is 5 meters above the ground and moving downwards with the speed v is equal to 5 meters per second. How fast is it moving when in meters per second it hits the ground? So you have pulley with masses here and here, and they are equal masses, M and M, um, and this is 3 meters, and it's overall 8 meters from the ground. Uh, it says initially, and we know it's three meters because it says that it's five meters above the ground. Five meters above the ground. Okay? So, what you want to do, oh, and then the last thing is the velocity here is equal to five meters per second originally. And you're looking for velocity final at the ground. Okay, looks like com it looks pretty complicated. Like you might have to do some kinetic, kinematic, uh, or uh, energy work. But there's a trick. There's a trick to this question. Really, you have two equal masses on a frictionless pulley, and those are the only forces. Or those are the only things that are affecting it. So you have mg being pulled down here, as well as mg being pulled down here. You can envision this. I always try and think, pulleys are hard to visual, or to conceptually understand. Unless you stretch it out, and so basically you have a tug of war going on with mg being pulled this way, and mg being pulled this way, with the, pu the pulleys right here, but whatever, that doesn't matter, the mg and mg, they cancel out perfectly. So there is f net is equal to zero. There is no net force at all affecting this. And with, with no net force, f net is equal, so f net is equal to zero, which is equal to mass times acceleration. There is no acceleration. There is zero, if the mass, is, there, is, there is mass, but there's no acceleration because it, the F net is zero. So, what does that mean? That means it starts out at five meters per second, it's going to end at five meters per second. The velocity is going to stay the same throughout the thing because with no net force, there's no change in velocity. The Teaching Center, UF's Learning Support Center, www.teachingcenter.ufl.edu.